Hi, it's Elder, and in this video we're going to talk about structuring the content using headings. Having informative and engaging content is important for any website, and it is also very important how we structure it, because we can structure the web page so it is easy to read not only to humans, but also for Google and it's robots who will be indexing your page. And we can structure the content on our page using headings. So here we have the blocks project. And as you know, when we select the text in blocks, we have these eight types of text available to us. So there is the heading from one to six, there is a paragraph and label. And the headings are what I'm talking about in this video. So if we go, for example, to the other page, you can see that we have quite different text for each of the sections. And if we select the biggest one, as you can see, it is H1, heading one. And heading one is the most important heading of the page. And it should only represent the title or the topic of this page. So here, the title of this page is what I can do. So basically the services. And as you can see, I selected heading one and heading one should be used only once on a page. Do not use it more than once. It will be not very good for your uh, performance, SEO performance. And heading two, as you can see here, I'm using that for the section. So use heading one for the title of the page, use heading two for the bigger sections. For example, here I have my services or this email newsletter, for example. And for subtitles or like smaller sections of our website, we can use heading three and you get the idea. You basically create the structure when the lower the number is, the more important the heading is. So heading one will be always the most important. Heading two will represent the bigger sections. Heading three will represent smaller sections and so on course text will be paragraph so it is very important and as you can see let's go to some other other template for example this foundation template as you can see I have the same structure here so foundation template is the name of this website it is heading one if we scroll down here upcoming events it's the name of the section is heading two and the subtitle or title of the event is heading three and this is just the text and it is the same story across all of my websites of course i'm not doing this perfectly as well but i'm trying to follow this hierarchy every time i can so here as well you can as you can see this is the section title and i'm using heading two so to summarize use headings to create the structure on the page so it's easier to read for users and for google as well so thank you for watching this video and I will talk to you in the next one.